Okay, so the first place I went to was Forever 21. And it's really weird because um, I'm not really one to buy clothes from Forever 21. I usually just buy like accessories, but I've been buying some clothes from there lately. Um, so anyways, um, it's two trips. I didn't buy this all in one trip, but, um, okay, so, first thing, so I saw this shirt on the website, and, um, I was a little iffy about it, because I, like, last year I didn't get into the whole crop top thing, like, I don't know, I just feel like, I don't know, I just feel weird, like, walking around with my stomach exposed. I know it's, like, what's in right now, but I just feel like I don't have any clothes on. But I saw this shirt, and I thought it was really cute, and I thought maybe for, like, a concert or something, not, like, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll just suck it up and wear it. I don't know. But I saw it, and I was going to order it on the website, and then I was like, no, and then I saw it in the store, and I was just like, whatever, I'll just buy it. So, and it's actually, it's sold out on the website now, so that's what made me buy it. But it's like this cropped um, fluorescent like coral and pink floral shirt and it's scoop neck and then the back is what is the best because it has this cute little cutout on the back. So it looks like that. And it was like super cheap. Um, it was only $7. It was part of their, like, spring deals or whatever. So I got that. Then, um, I got a couple jewelry pieces. So first I bought these earrings, which are just black bows. And these were only $2.80. And then I bought this long, simple gold necklace and it just has like a hammered heart at the bottom and this was $3.80 um, and then my second trip I bought a crap load of earrings um, I used to always wear like the dangly earrings but then when I started wearing glasses I don't wear them as often just because I feel like it's like too much going on like up here so I only wear studs and Forever 21 is like one of the favorite places for me to get my studs so um, the first pair I bought are these and they're just really like shimmer they're really like really glitzy and they're blue and they have, they're like outlined in diamonds. I'm sorry, the focus on this camera kind of sucks, but the quality is better. So, um, I got these cutout heart earrings. Oh, and then these ones were $2.80. These ones were $2.80. Um, then I got just these plain like silver hearts. These were $1.50. Um, I got these turquoise hearts with all these like fluorescent gems on them. These were $3.80 and then I bought another pair of the bow earrings but in silver and then these were $2.80. So I got all those and then I bought, um, so I bought this dress which was like super cute. It looks like this. It's black and it's got flor a floral pattern, pink floral pattern. It came with a belt too. I don't know where the belt went, but it came with a belt. Looks like this. And then it, once again, the back is a cutout back. Looks like that. So it just looks like that. And this was also part of their like summer steals, summer deals, spring deals, whatever. And this was originally seven so and um, this was originally 1780 and then I got it as like a pink tag for ten dollars so I got that and then I got this um, tank top from there um, if you've watched my videos for a while you know like my guilty pleasure is like Lil Wayne I'm a big Lil Wayne fan whatever anyway <laughs> um, they had this tank top there. It's like one of the loose fit tank tops and the arms drop down a lot. Um, and it just has Lil Wayne, it has a picture of him, and I'm going to the concert in the summer, so I figured 
I buy that. Um, then I bought this shirt, which I saw this too, and um, this is a white, like, kind of muscle tee, and it's got Tupac on it, and it says, all eyes on me. So I just figured it'd be like a nice shirt to wear in the summer. Um, and then I bought this headband. Um, this looks like that. It was $2.80. I just figured it's cute. Looks like that. Um, so that's all I got from Forever 21. Then I went to um, Aerie and oh, I have hair in my mouth. So I went to Aerie, and Aerie um, has my favorite bandos. Um, they are, they come in like the best colors. There's, I don't know, I just really like them. I bought a hot pink one last year and I wore it like a lot. So I wanted to get more this year. Um, everything, they're originally $12.95, but everything was 40% off the other day. So I got them for like really cheap. Um, but I got uh, this like bright blue one, looks like this. And then I got this bright coral one, which is probably going to mess up the coloring on the, whatever. This looks like that. This is bright coral one. So I got those. And then I seen this shirt. So it was like an impulse buy. Um, but it just looks like this. It's just like kind of like a baby, baby doll tank top. And then the back is like all lace. Back is all lace. Um, and this was originally $24.95, then it was marked down to $19.99, and then I got another 40% off of that. So that was that. That was all I got from Aerie. And then, uh, where did I go next? Next, I went to Victoria's Secret. I went intending on buying these shirts that I saw on the website, um, if you've been on the website, I'm sure you've seen them. They're really cute. Um, they are just a plain t-shirt in the front, and then the back, they have like this little strip at the top, and then the whole back is cut out, which I was like, oh, super cute. And then I went and tried them on, and one thing I hate about Victoria's Secret is a lot of the times they'll make their clothes like that really big baggy fit, and I'm not into that. I never will be into that. I want my clothes to fit. I don't want it to look like I'm wearing like somebody else's clothes. So I tried on an extra small and it looked like I had like an extra large on. So I didn't buy those. But then next to them they had these shirts which I tried on and they were pretty cute so I bought those. They were two for 30 and they're just these plain tank tops. Um, they just look like this but um, as you can see the it's it's cut out a lot right here so when you wear a bandeau with these it looks really super cute. Um, so I got hot pink and I also bought this in purple and I bought extra small if anyone's wondering. So I also bought it in purple so it just looks like that and like I said these do look really cute with like bandos under them. Um, that's all I got from Victoria's Secret. Then I went to Pacific Sunwear. Everything was buy one get one half off so um, I got some things. So the first thing I got was this shirt, which I think this is also going to be like a type of like going out concert shirt for me. I don't know if I would ever wear this like on a regular basis, um, but it just looks like this in the front. It's got like this black and white, I guess, tribal print. Looks like that. But then in the back, it has these cutouts right here and right here. So it's really cute. Um, really like that. So it looks like that. That was, um, how much were you? That was $19.50. And then I got this t-shirt. Um, and the brand of this was Nolly. Then I bought this t-shirt, which is also by Nolly. And Noli, Nolly, whatever. Um, and it's just like the softest t-shirt ever. Um, it's like a cream color and then it has this floral 
pattern all over it. And it's a v-neck t-shirt. It's really soft. Just has like this floral pattern. Um, and the price of this was $16.50. And I did buy that in an extra small. Um, the next shirt I got was one of the... Uh, um, Given into this trend, the peplum trend, I think is what it's called. I'm not really good about keeping up with trends, but I just saw it and I thought it was cute, so I bought it. Um, it was $24.50 by the brand Kiera. And it's purple. It's like this purple kind of gauzy material. And it's got a cutout in the back, and then it just looks like that. So I got that, and then I got um, this shirt, which is by the brand also Kira. I got it in an extra small. Um, it's kind of scooped in the front and back. Um, it's like a really super soft material, and then it's mint and white striped with these bright floral patterns on them. So it looks like that. And this was uh, $19.50. So that's all I got from um, Pacific Sunwear. And then my mother was nice enough to buy me a shirt. Um, we were in Buckle. And I love Buckle. And I think their stuff's really cute. But their stuff is like super expensive. And just like, ugh. I mean, I would rather get like three shirts for the price that I'm going to pay for one. So, um... She saw me with a shirt in my hand, I put it down, and then she was generous enough to buy it for me. So thank you, Mother. But this is what it looks like. Um, it's this coral color. And then on the front, it has all of these really super pretty beading. You can see up close sequins and studs. And it just looks like that in the front. And then on the back, it dips down like that. So I thought that was like super... Super cute, and this was $42.95, so a little bit pricey. Um, and then the last thing, so I all of a sudden like got the urge, I'm like, I really want some colored jeans. Um, because I've been seeing everyone wear them, and I just like I'm really picky about the way my jeans fit, so um it's just been I'm having trouble finding some. And then I went to JC Penny's the other night. And lo and behold, like on a $10 clearance rack, they had like all of these super cute colors of skinny jeans. They were like $10 and they had my size left in like every color. So it was like a major score. Um, I only bought two pair and they were distressed. So that was like a plus because like I really like them when they're kind of distressed. But anyway, I bought these hot pink pair and as you can see, they're like distressed. Um, so I bought this hot pink pair, and then I bought this really pretty light lavender pair. Looks like this. So, yep. So that was the end of my massive spring haul. Um, I'm going to try and stop myself from buying anything until summer clothes start coming out. Because I think I'm pretty good for now. But, um, yeah. So, um, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next video.